Grammy winner, American singer and actress Sissy Houston, who was a two-time Grammy-winning soul and gospel artist, best known for her work with American R&B girl group The Sweet Inspirations. Sissy passed away on the 7th of October, 2024. She won a Grammy Award for her traditional soul gospel album Face to Face in 1997 and again the following year for He Leadeth Me. Known for her powerful voice, she contributed background vocals to many hits, including Franklin's Ain't No Way and Van Morrison's Brown Eyed Girl. She is the mother of American singer and actress Whitney Houston. Sissy died of complications from Alzheimer's disease at the age of 91. American football player Pat Fisher, who's best known for playing alongside teams like the St. Louis Cardinals and Washington Redskins. He played 17 seasons in the NFL from 1961 to 1977, starting with the St. Louis Cardinals and then moving to the Washington Redskins, where he played for a decade. Pat passed away on the 8th of October, 2024. He died of natural causes at the age of 84. Moroccan actress Naima Lamcharki, who's being remembered for her work in movies and TV shows such as Casablanca, Nest of Spies, and Blood Wedding. In 2021, she won the Best Actress Award at Sweden's 11th Annual Malmo Arab Film Festival, or MAF. Naima died on the 5th of October, 2024. She died of natural causes at the age of 81. American football player and coach Greg Landry, who was a former NFL quarterback and assistant coach, best known for his work with teams like Detroit Lions and Chicago Bears. He was a quarterback in the National Football League, or NFL, and USFL from 1968 to 1984. He was selected in the first round of the 1968 NFL Draft with the 11th overall pick. Landry passed away on the 4th of October, 2024. He died at the age of 77. No cause of death has been revealed yet. Oscar winner British actress Dame Maggie Smith, who's being remembered for her appearances in movies and TV shows such as The Prime of Miss John Brody, Harry Potter, and Downtown Abbey. Dame passed away on the 27th of September, 2024. She won her first Academy Award for Best Actress in 1969 for The Prime of Miss John Brody and her second Oscar in 1978 for Best Supporting Actress in California Suite. Dame is widely known for her role as the strict yet fair Professor Minerva McGonagall in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone in 2001, a character she reprised throughout the Harry Potter film series. Dame died of natural causes at the age of 89. Canadian-born American television writer Alan Blay who's being remembered for his work in movies and TV shows such as The Smothers Brothers Comedy Hour and The Sonny and Cher Comedy Hour. Bile also tried his luck in acting. He played Captain Bly on Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood in the 1960s. Bly passed away on the 4th of October, 2024. He died of natural causes at the age of 87. French film director and actor Michael Blanc who's most popular for his work in movies and TV shows such as Gross Fatigue, Summer Things, and Marche à l'Ombre. He's one of a few people to have won awards at the Cannes Film Festival, both as a creative director and performing role as an actor. Blanc passed away on the 3rd of October, 2024. He died of a heart attack at the age of 72. American Hall of Fame golfer, U.S. Women's Open champion, Susie Burning, who secured her place in golf history by winning three U.S. Women's Open titles in 1968, 1972, and 1973. Susie passed away on the 2nd of October, 2024. She was one of only six women to win the prestigious championship three times. In 1971, Burning received one of the first golf scholarships for women at Oklahoma City University, where she played on the men's team. 
She had 11 career LPGA Tour titles and was the 1964 Rookie of the Year. Susie died of lung cancer at the age of 83. According to her daughter, she was suffering from lung cancer for two years. Tony winner, American actor Gavin Creel, best known for his work in musical theater, his popular musics are Thoroughly Modern Millie, The Book of Mormon, Hello, and Dolly. Creel passed away on the 30th of September 2024. He won his first Tony Award for Best Featured Actor in a Musical for his role in the 2017 revival of Hello, Dolly. He also tried his luck on TV and appeared in Ryan Murphy's miniseries American Horror Stories in 2021, where he starred alongside Matt Bomer in a two-episode arc. Creel died of malignant peripheral nerve sheath tumor at the age of 48. Dominican baseball player Ozzy Virgil Sr., who's being remembered for playing alongside teams like the New York Giants, Detroit Tigers, and Pittsburgh Pirates. Ozzy passed away on the 29th of September, 2024. In 1956, he made his debut with the New York Giants, making an important milestone for Dominican athletes. He spent nine seasons in the majors as a catcher, third baseman, and outfielder for five teams. Virgil's son, Ozzy Jr., was a two-time All-Star catcher during an 11-year career from 1980 to 1990. Ozzy died of pancreatitis at the age of 92. Grammy winner, American Hall of Fame singer-songwriter, Chris Christofferson, who's being remembered for his hit songs such as Me and Bobby McGee, Help Me Make It Through the Night, and For the Good Times. Chris passed away on the 28th of September, 2024. He was a three-time Grammy Award winner out of 13 total nominations. Chris also tried his luck in acting, appearing in popular movies such as Cisco Pike, Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid, and Bloom in Love. He was also nominated for an Academy Award for Best Original Score for the film Songwriter in 1984. He was inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame in 2004. In 2021, Chris, who suffered from memory loss, announced his retirement from country music. Chris passed away of natural causes at the age of 88 while he was surrounded by his family at his home. Italian actor Glauco Mauri, who's best known for showing his acting skills in movies and TV shows such as China is Near, Deep Red, and Ecce Bombo. Mauri died in Rome on the 28th of September, 2024. He died of natural causes at the age of 93.